Sometimes we'll be able to solve exponential equations without using a calculator, without using logarithms. When we can, what we want to look at is the base. Is there any way to write these two sides so that they have the same base? Well, I could write the left-hand side as a base 3, and I could write the right-hand side as a base 3. So let's see how we could do this. 1 third, remember, is 3 to the negative 1, then to the x minus 1. 9 is 3 squared to the 2x. Now, we can use a property of exponents, so an exponent raised to another exponent, they multiply. So over here we have 3 to the negative x minus 1. Over here, same thing, we have 3 to the 4x. Now, exponential functions are what we call 1 to 1. For each input there's a unique output, but also for each output there's a unique input. Which means, if the bases are the same, the exponents have to be the same. So I'm going to set negative x minus 1 equal to 4x. And now solve. I distribute the negative. I got negative x plus 1 equals 4x. Add x to both sides, so I have 5x equals 1. Or finally, x equals 1 fifth. And that's how we can solve using like bases. We do what we need to do to get both sides to have the same base, and then we can set their exponents equal to each other.